Today we are going to bottle aqua. I am now I'm cleaning, cleaning it. I'm cleaning, cleaning it. English, please. Uh, no, no, no. We are, no. Not, we are not tired. Carlo Blanc de Blanc. Blanc de Blanc. Carlo Blanc de Blanc. Carlo Blanc de Blanc. Carlo Blanc de Blanc. Blanc de Blanc. Blanc de Blanc. And Blanc de Blanc for. Carlo Blanc de Blanc. Hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today it's bottling day. Today we are going to bottle 9000 bottles of our sparkling wine Carlo and also our wine brother's new project Carlo Blanc de Blanc which will be in stock in 2026. <laughs> 2026 in 6 years. So, let's go to business. De Cuvée. This is the yeast. We, I was preparing the yeast for the second fermentation, which will be bought in the bottles. And today we'll bottle the 5,000 liters of Carlo and 1,500 liters of Blanc de Blanc, which will be five years on yeast. Usually we made around four to five thousand bottles per year of our Carlo, but as you know, we started with Wine Brothers. We set our goals bigger. Uh, we want to accomplish them, so we decided to make more bottles and also new one, new wine, sparkling wine, uh, Carlo Blanc de Blanc. Before we start bottling, we needed an extra tube, so now I'm cleaning it, so the wine will be also clean. What will be the wine? Clean and perfect. First bottle, ah, we, today we start bottling with Manium Scarlo 2020, the first bottle guys. We are preparing the place for the smaller bottles and we'll put them like this because we don't have much space and we're gonna put them I don't know how to say but in this position so it'll be like a wall of bottles this will be the wall bottom wall we will also make a time lapse so here is carlo 2018 2019 2017 is already in the bottles and now let's prepare 2020 tom hi danica How it's going guys? I'm nervous. As you see, Rock and Jure are already putting the bottles on the floor. This is the first time that we are doing that because we usually put it in these plastic rows which were made especially for Carlo but it takes too much space because this year 2020 we are doubling our production of sparkling wine from four to five thousand bottles we today we today this year we are going to make nine thousand and because of that we're going to put it like this but it's a big 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 risk and we hope that it will it will be all right that none of the bottle will I don't know, explode or something like that. So, finger crossed.
We are about to finish Carlo our extra brood which will be three years on East. And now we are getting ready for our new project Wine Brothers, Carlo Blanc de Blanc. The end. It's not the end. It's time for Blanc de Blanc. That's it guys, the last bottles of Blanc de Blanc. Guys, are you tired? English, please. Uh, no, no, no. We, are no. Not, we are not tired. Such a big pile of trash. Now we have, now we just have to clean everything up. It's eight o'clock. 8 o'clock guys, great day, great experience, here is our main worker, <laughs> Grega. Yesterday we finished late and I just quickly cleaned all the wine cellar and washed the inox tanks and today we have to put all the bottles that we bottled yesterday in place, so there will be for Carlo for 3 years and Blanc de Blanc for 5 years, which will be fermenting in this room and the temperature must be controlled between 10, 10 to 13 degrees Celsius all the time. So as we told you at the beginning of the video, we have some problem with space because usually we make four to 5,000 uh, bottles per year. This, this year we, we did uh, a step forward or two steps forward. We did 9,000 bottles. This is a huge project for us. Also, we started Wine Brothers for a reason. We have big plans for the future. So guys, follow our story, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and see you in the next episode, guys. Bye.